So this time we'll look at how to turn on Ragdoll. In with your character selected, um, open up your blueprint editor, find some space and we're just going to do a simple test. In fact, first you're going to want to select your character mesh in the components. Scroll down till you see collision. On collision preset, change from character mesh to ragdoll. And that'll be that for there. Let's do this on an input test. So I'm just going to type in right click and type in input Z. So when Z is pressed, let's do a print string just to make sure that we're receiving input, which we should be. And let's sim set simulate physics on our mesh. Set simulate physics on mesh and turn that to true. Hit compile. Let's give this a test. So it can still walk as normal. Walk, 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 and press Z, and we fall over. No, I mean, yeah. Cool, look at that. How awesome is that? Um, note the camera disattached from the body. It's because the camera is actually attached to the um, collision. So instead, I'm going to drag and drop this onto my mesh like that to fix that problem. And now I can still move my arrow, but I can't actually keep walking forward and move D. Um, okay, let's test this with a collision. So we're going to get our capsule collider, scroll down until we see on component hit, and we'll grab this event. And what we'll say is with the other, if the other component has tag, um, which we'll need to set up in a minute, but we'll call it rag for ragdoll. And we'll create a branch. If we hold B and left click, we can create a branch. Or true story, this is actually just an if statement. So we can just type in if and drag that off. And then if this is true, um, what we'll do is let's copy and paste you and set up like that. Um, now we're going to need to choose the component that does this. So I've got a few balls up here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to scroll down um, and on collision, I'm going to turn on this to simulate hit event because remember we're saying on, on capsule hit. And then we want to go to tags and type in what we set up, which is rag for ragdoll. So let's press play, see if it works. And it does. Cool. Awesome.